What's up, guys? It's your host, Chef Goat, and we are back to Detroit Become Human. Now, I am telling you guys right now, like, the hairs on my, my arms are just standing up right now because we've gone through such an emotional roller coaster, and it's not even done yet. How how crazy is this, guys? I am loving this series. I truly am. Now, before we start the next episode, if I could please get you guys to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, and spread the word, it'd be greatly appreciated. But guys, let's get right back into it. Let's see what happens next. November 6, 2038. Oh, I'm Connor again, right? Find Amanda. Who's Amanda? Is that Amanda? Looks like Amanda. I don't know. Why am I here and... What am I doing here? I don't understand. This is really pretty, though. Very feng shui, you know, like Mr. Miyagi type garden, you know, bonsai and all that. Are you Amanda? Hello, Amanda. Oh, I guess so. Connor, it's good to see you. Finding that deviant was far from easy. Mm, yeah, well, I guess. You showed great skill in your investigation. Thank you. But you knew deviants could be unstable. You should have been more cautious. I thought I could make it talk. It was a judgment error. Never mind. I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future. Okay. What the... The interrogation seemed... Challenging. What did you think of the deviant? Um, traumatized. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. Yeah. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Um, kind of an asshole. Um. Um, I say intriguing. I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But I also think he used to be a good detective. Yeah, I think so. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Um, I don't know. Indifferent, adapt, friendly. I will try to establish a friendly relationship. If I can get him to trust me, it will be helpful for the investigation. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. Okay. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. Okay. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. Well, thank you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Ah, well, I, I'm unsure what to make of this. You know, this whole garden and her and, you know, like, I don't know. This is weird. Okay, we're at a police department. Look for Lieutenant Anderson. Mr. Anderson. I keep thinking about, you know, um, the Matrix. I love it. You might be in shock. Just, just Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new yeah. level. No access a without prior authorization. An American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Okay. Several warning shots were exchanged, apparently with no damage or casualties. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Beep. Mind connect. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Oh, thank you very much, ma'am. Robot ma'am. Or as Delirious would say, Robot Hoochie. Alright. You know, he calls everybody Hoochie, right? I'm just bringing this up because it's... it's if you look up the definition of Hoochie, it's, it's pretty darn bad, guys. Hoochie is bad. Just saying. Alright. Um... Okay, there's a lot I can do here.
L1. Miller. Okay. Reed. Brown. Pearson. Collins. Okay. Probably this one because it's the most messiest. Yep. I knew it. He's got the most messy desk. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Hmm. Um, sit down. Okay. I think we should tidy up his desk. He's got a bunch of donut boxes and stuff. Explore new office. Okay. I guess we're going to explore then. Learn about Lieutenant Anderson. What does he like to listen to? So he likes uh, death metal. Interesting. Okay. Wouldn't have picked him for that. I was kind of picture him for a jazz guy. Analyze. See what he likes. Um, traces of caffeine. Okay, well, we knew he likes coffee. He's not a good uh, Japanese maple. I got one of those. Not a very good housekeeper, you know, or gardener. Taking care of his plants. He likes his donuts. That's pretty easy to tell. Um, anti android slogans. Okay, so he's in depth with that. He's a Detroit basketball fan. Okay. Uh, more than 50 arrests throughout the country. Detroit's finest. Blah, 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 blah. If you want to read that, Detective Anderson promoted to the rank of lieutenant. New record seizure of red ice in Detroit. Okay, so. So he's a good cop. He's a good cop. Okay. What's this? He has a dog, a St. Bernard. Okay, very nice. Um, multi department unit. A hole apparently is uh, the one guy. Good guy, real police, not sure. Okay, interesting, interesting. And he goes to Jimmy's bar a lot. Okay. All right, analysis complete. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! Mr. Krabs. In my office. By the way, guys, if you didn't know, but Lieutenant Anderson also voices Mr. Krabs. My good friend Sam, a.k.a. Boulevard DW, um, let me know to that. I, I recognized him, but I didn't recognize him that well, obviously, or else I would have shouted it out in the first one. It's pretty cool. On my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now... We're getting reports of assaults, and even homicide, like that guy last night. Mm -hmm. This isn't just CyberLife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I... Sorry, guys, but I had to pause it just for a second, because this whole scenario right here reminds me of that movie um, with Will Smith, um, AI. I mean, same kind of chief cop, same kind of detective, except for obviously it's Mr. Krabs instead of Will Smith, and he's working with an android. You know, it's like they kind of just ripped it off from that. I don't know. I just thought it was funny. You gotta be the one to deal with this shit. <coughs> I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. But I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the hey, settings on my own phone. That's my name. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Oh. CyberLife sent over this android to help with the investigation. 
It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Oh. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn Hoo-ah. mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. <laughs> I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So yeah. I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. <laughs> this conversation is over. I love it. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Woo! Poor lieutenant. He just got told, man. File, positive, uh, leave. I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best. Close the door on your way out. Okay, well. Have a nice day, Captain. He doesn't like me either, so I'm just trying to be friendly. It looks like he's a Detroit fan too. Progress the case. Check on Hank. Okay. Um, I'm gonna check the progress. If it'll let me. What's this? Oh, famous Detroit painter dies. Yeah, we know this. That was a bunch of crap, guys. Alright, I don't care. Whatever. Let's talk to Lieutenant. Um, understanding, constructive, pragmatic. Um, let's be understanding. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Um, positive partners. Um, in any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. God, I can't do shit. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Well, perfect. Thank you, partner. All right, let's sit down. Let's do this. Um, anti anti androids. Um, let's talk about the dog. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair is on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. See, I'm working in. Okay, um. Uh, let's talk about Fowler. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. Too long. Uh -huh. Touch the nerves there. Okay, now let's uh, talk about basketball. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. Um, music? Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Eh. Well, yes. I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. <laughs> He's like, what the? Um, hours, uh, Antoy, Androids. A lot of people don't appreciate having Androids around. 
I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah, that's a good question. Yeah, there is one. I think Android killed his partner, maybe. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay? Not trying to. Okay, I guess that's all we can do. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. Thank you very much. He's trying to be freaking friendly, but you're just being an a-hole, man. <laughs> Alright, missing. Um, okay. Suspect. Wait, I recognize that dude. Um, he's the one with the screwed up face, right? Okay. Lunged at him. Unexpectedly attempted to strangle him before leaving the scene. That's that's that dude. At least it looks like him. A victim. Um, attacked by an android. Okay. Scan all files. Oh, that's a lot. 243 files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have assaulted a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. Yeah, I would say so. Um, professional, aggressive, direct, understanding. Understand. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them, and... Hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? I'm just trying to be, a-hole. Resign the mission, threaten, determined. I've been assigned hey. this mission, Lieutenant. Take a look at these samples. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Ooh! Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Ooh. Uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX400 that attacked the guy last night. I guess I made the wrong decision on that one. I'm on it. Wow. Uh, I better be more careful, guys. That apparently did not go as I had planned. I was hoping to become buddy buddy, and that did not go well. It could have ain't got the lead. It could have gone a different way, but yeah, I I don't know. You know, it's oh, famous partner dies. Okay, so that's I I knew I was right. Right there, famous partner dies. Okay, so that's what pissed off Hank about androids. All right. Well, guys, I'm going to have to end the video here. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to please show your support by liking, commenting, subscribing, turning on notifications, and spreading the word. And I will see you in the next one. I'm your host, Chef Goat, and I'm out. Peace.